Yo, what's going on guys? It's Gamer here, back again with another video, and I'm just gonna go jump straight into the video because uh, the first time I recorded it, uh, the audio didn't record, so yeah, I'm, g I'm gonna start complaining and just j jump right into uh, what's what happened in episode 88 of Dragon Ball Super. So the beginning of the episode begins off with uh, uh, Gohan and Piccolo actually training together. Uh, Gohan's basically trying to get his fighting spirit back, I guess, so that way he's actually properly prepared for the Tournament of Power, which is ultimately the, uh, the goal of what he's trying to get. Just get whatever strength he can, uh, so he's ultimately just, like I said, ready for the inevitable, for what is going to happen, or potentially happen, in uh, the Tournament of Power. And so uh, we skip off a couple of scenes. And uh, we actually see a scene of uh, Go, uh, not Gohan, I'm sorry, Goku and Piccolo actually talking to each other. And Goku actually told Piccolo uh, what's at stake with the Tournament of Power. Uh, and when, what happens is that for those of you who don't know for some reason, uh, whoever loses the Tournament of Power, there's 12 universes, and let's say uh, Universe actually loses the Tournament of Power uh, in this Battle Royale clash of all 12 universes, right? What will happen is, is that the losing tournaments actually get completely erased from existence, basically. And whoever wins, uh, they they stay existing, obviously. And they also get Super Dragon Balls. So Piccolo knows he knows what's at stake, and he's basically trying to train Gohan back to his his full strength. And that's basically what kind of happens throughout this whole episode. Uh, I'm gonna try to keep this short. I'm not gonna go off with a uh, full explanation of what happened throughout the whole. Uh, uh, episode. I'll, uh, e either way, I might end up doing it anyway, so I guess it doesn't really matter. So, we go to the next scene. Uh, we have a little funny moment uh, where Trunks is trying to change uh, of, of, uh, for Bulla, or Bra, uh, her her diaper, because if you don't know, somehow, I guess, uh, Bra is the second child for Bulma and Vegeta. So, Trunks is trying to change a diaper for the first time, right? While Bulma is on the phone talking to someone who's probably most likely her sister, Tights. I believe that's what her name is, but that's besides the point. The funny moment that I'm talking about is actually between uh, Whis and Beerus, and he goes off talking about they wouldn't act this way if they knew the truth, and they wouldn't be so carefree. And then Whis is like, are you sure you want them to know the truth? Excuse me. And so, uh, we, uh, we just kind of goes off saying, like, this is going to happen, this is going to happen. And basically, it, it, it shows, I said it a little bit, I'm sorry. Uh, it shows an extra scene of uh, basically Bulma getting pissed off at uh, Beerus for letting, letting this happen, you know, for the universe is potentially going to get erased. And she's basically blaming Beerus for letting it happen. And Beerus goes off saying, well, Goku kind of went off on his own willingly so it's not my fault it's his and then she's like no you kind of uh you kind of just let him do it you didn't even try to stop him did you and he's like no i obviously tried and then she's going off saying like and you call yourself a god stuff like that whatever whatever it's kind of just a funny moment of like what uh could possibly happen if bulma knew what was at stake next scene is of krillin and 18 they're training together as are uh, Piccolo and Gohan, and that's basically kind of what's going on, like all throughout the, uh, the the world right now, with all of the fighters for the term of power, obviously. And so the next scene, we jump back off with uh, Piccolo and Gohan uh, back to their training grounds, uh, basically, and then Piccolo is basically going off uh, on Gohan, saying like, "This is what's wrong with you. You could fix it, but you you need to fix it." before you know the actual tournament of power starts because if you don't do it we're gonna die <laughs> that's basically what's going off right now this entire time piccolo is just telling him like this is gonna happen you need to fix this or else we're dead and stuff like that right i'm gonna jump off a couple of scenes uh later where basically uh it's kaba uh from universe six 
and then he's going off he's trying to talk to someone whose name is uh, Renzo I believe and he's like trying to convince him to join the tournament of power so universe six so universe six can win instead of universe seven universe 11 stuff like that whatever right and so Renzo actually goes off says like I'm retired from like the forts uh, the defense force whatever bullshit right and so he's actually like if you're so persistent about it then how about you actually go and take my sister and those of you who are, pro are probably excited to hear this but we do get conf uh, confirmation of uh, the female Broly's name I'm not gonna try to say her name because I'm gonna butcher it and I really don't want to butcher it until I actually kinda hear it for myself and then once I get that I'm gonna be like oh so that's how you say it and now that makes actually a little bit more sense so right now I'm not gonna say her name because I don't want to butcher it but if you guys want to know what her name is just go check on people's Twitters they've, they've already like we're like oh they're all like oh my god that's your name the Dragon Ball community got it right you know because everyone in the Dragon Ball community was basically trying to find out what her name was people came up with their own basically fan uh, named uh, names for the character and then one of them ultimately ended up being uh, correct so it's kind of weird and so uh, I'm gonna skip a couple of scenes uh, later but Piccolo has basically uh, beaten Gohan and it's really weird because Gohan just like just loses he's he's weaker obviously because he hasn't trained for uh, many many years but now it's just like he's he's uh, he's weaker he couldn't even beat Piccolo it's it's just like how is this happening you know and it's because Gohan is almost overestimating himself like a lot of the times so he gets too overly confident and so for those of you who remember back in Z, Super Buu, when he, he was fighting Gohan, or rather Mystic Gohan, Ultimate Gohan, whatever you want to call him, uh, Gohan was significantly uh, pow more powerful than him, and through that, he became super arrogant, he became overconfident, and because of that, that had caused him to uh, be absorbed by Super Buu, and as actually mentioned uh, later on, uh, later on uh, in the episode, uh, after Gohan finally awakens his uh, his ultimate power that was awakened by Elder Kai back from Z, and it's just uh, he kind of just let his guard down against Super Buu, and that actually happens the same thing against Piccolo, and Piccolo's just like telling him this that etc etc um, this is a really bad review I'm sorry I'm just really agitated at the fact that the f the first to uh, the first take I'm sorry uh, didn't record uh, the audio and I'm really pissed off about that but that's what's at the point um, Piccolo catches Gohan off guard uh, he's telling him you let your guard down again still even though the fight wasn't even over this like uh, just this that whatever you're getting careless uh, you gotta lose your arrogance and stuff like that. We jump off to another scene, and he's like, Piccolo's like, don't you want to see how much stronger you can get? Do you, do you not want to see how much further you can get? And uh, he, they kind of just go off, train a little bit more, obviously, because they still need to get stronger. They, they're getting prepared and stuff like that for the tournament of power. And I'm very excited. It's the end of the episode, basically. Uh, that's kind of basically where it leaves off at. There's like 9 hours, 30 minutes left until the Tournament of Power uh, officially begins. I'm excited to see what's to come. Honestly, I can't tell you definitively what is going to happen. Uh, because for people who are just waiting for new episodes to come out and not looking at like future episode spoilers, you're all just wondering and w just waiting to see what will happen. And that's basically... Well, I do, because I don't want to see uh, what's what's to happen in future episodes. Because I kind of just want to experience it as if it's a fresh new thing. I don't want to know what's going to happen ahead of time and then not get surprised by it. You know, I feel like that's just. I feel like I just. Uh, I feel like it's just dumb, and I don't. I, I don't like. I, I don't like doing that. But I'm not uh, disregarding other people who do it because. You know, they're letting people know. They're letting people know, and that's perfectly fine. You know, I just like to be surprised uh, beforehand as the episode's going on instead of ahead of time. So anyways, 
Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up the video here. If you guys enjoy, be sure to drop a like. If you're brand new to the channel, be sure be sure to consider subscribing to the channel. And uh, that's basically it. I'll see you guys next time. I hope you guys are having a wonderful um, morning, afternoon, night, whenever you're watching this video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.